Hello, hello, everyone. Um, so I am coming on here to share something. Many of you I already know this because I did it on live. Um, many of you already know this because I already shared it on live. But for those of you all who don't know, um, I was in my prayer room, my prayer closet, back at the old place that I used to live in Missouri. And when I was in there and I was praying, while I was praying to the Lord, he showed me a vision of a meteor. And I was like, whoa. I also saw, I'm just going to share the fact that I saw a vision of a meteor, okay? And um, it was confirmed that I did see a meteor because my son, he ended up having a dream about a meteor. So I knew that the Lord was just confirming to me that I did see a meteor and um, that I saw it coming, a meteor coming. Now, I didn't have no, I didn't put a video up about it like I did for the tornadoes and stuff like that. And I'm going to start putting up more of the visions and things that the Lord showed me because I want you all to know what God has allowed me to see, what Holy Spirit has allowed me to see by way of vision, um, that we can pray and we can stand the gap and we can just be in a place of preparation for those things, making sure you're continually covering yourself um, with the blood of Jesus, right? So this morning, I look up, y'all, again, those who are witnesses, y'all already know because y'all seen the live and y'all can drop it down in the comments for me, my sisters and my brothers in Christ. Y'all can drop it down in the comments because y'all already know that you you already know that the Lord talked to me about it and I shared it with you all. I want to say not just in one live, but actually two. But why this morning? This is what it shows here. Mm -hmm. NASA alert. Let me read it to y'all. NASA alert. alert. 1029 1, foot gigantic, gigantic space rock racing towards Earth. Earth. Check with distance with speed. speed. Did y'all just see how big that is coming towards the earth? Mm -hmm. Literally, I had a vision about this, about a meteor. They're calling it an asteroid. But see, we know meteors are bigger than asteroids, if I'm not mistaken. Yo, those of you all who are like science people or whatever, you can definitely uh, check me and correct me or whatever. I don't, I don't mind um, that. But I'm just going to put it up again. Look at that. No need to panic, right? Because we're covered by the Lord. We're covered by God. We are protected by the Lord. We are people who say our prayers and believe in God to protect us and have a hedge of protection around us. So we don't have to fear. But I'm just bringing this to you all because when the Lord shows you something and then you get to seeing things happening, right? Him showing me or speaking to me about tornadoes and then seeing things happening. Not that it's about them happening, right? Because I don't want to see nobody lose their life. I don't want to see people hurt. I don't want to see people's houses tore up and tore down or any of those things, you know. But for someone who is moving in their gift, you and you moving in your gift, and it may be a little bit early and you moving in your gift and you still trying to figure things out or you learning certain things, right? But when you start seeing God do these things, Right. It's it's like a undoubtedly, you know, that, you know, that, you know, God gave you this. Right. God knows all things. Holy Spirit revealed X, Y and Z to you. Right. Even if it's in a dream and you've seen certain things happen and then you see it happen in the natural you're like, hold on. Wait, I just had a dream about that. It's a little mind. It's mind blowing. Like, can we be honest? I mean, I think it's absolutely mind blowing. Right. And um, I really just wanted to share that with you all because I think it's crazy. And if you all check it out, um, it was on Times Now. That's the name of it if you all wanted to check it out. Or you could probably just type it in, NASA Alert or whatever, and check it in and see for yourself. But um, it's crazy. <laughs> it's crazy. And um, I feel like I possibly even know where, uh, what area it would land in based off of another vision the Lord gave me. Um, there was this, like, this, I'm just going to share it. There was this, like, deserted area or whatever. Look kind of like, maybe like by the, like a Grand Canyon kind of area or whatever. Like where there will be mountains and stuff. But like this, like somewhere where people don't really live at or whatever. Um, but And I, the reason why I say that is because I saw this massive hole like it was huge it, it looked like the size of something like that hidden the earth and I could just see the I couldn't see the the meteor in there 
it's like I can see it if the meteor wasn't in there, right? Like how an imprint would happen if you see a rock and you put a rock somewhere, you could see a little hole based off the rock. That's what I was able to see. So I saw a vision of that. I saw a vision of this deep um hole, kind of like a ditch, right? Or like some kind of pit, right? Of this imprint of a hole, like a big old boulder would be it or something like that. I hope y'all able to catch what I'm saying. So, huh? So, 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 weren't you just talking about like a big old hole? Yeah. Was it in space? No, it was here on Earth. It was a big hole. Like I said, it was like a big old ditch area, right? Imagine this, right? Hidden area. And because it hit a space, a hit a place, it left the imprint. Right, it hit and it dug into the earth, and you can see this big old area where something came into it. Y'all know what I'm talking about. I don't know the word. Come on now, y'all know what I'm saying. <laughs> you know what I'm saying. Um, but yeah, it left like an imprint. That's the word. I think that's a good word, imprint. Um, so I just wanted to share that just to say, like, let's stay in place of prayer. Um, and again, like I said, I feel like I even saw an area where it would go to. And I believe it would go to some area that's like probably mountains. Um, I feel like maybe northern. I don't know. Something like that. Rocky, kind of rocky area or mountain area or something like that. That's what I feel like it may. I don't know. Yeah, I don't know. I'm just telling y'all based off what I saw in my vision. Mom, okay. This kind of reminds me of the Paw Patrol movie when, when, so, when, yeah. the, meteor, when the meteor hit hit the hit a hit Adventure Bay in the Paw Patrol movie. Okay, so you saw a Paw Patrol movie and it was a meteor in yeah, it. Yeah, yeah, the Mighty Pups movie. Okay, you talking about movie. the Mighty Pups movie. So yeah, y'all, I just want to post that, um, just to share that with you all, and for those of you all who already know, y'all already know because we've been talking about it, but. Uh, for those of you who do not know, that way you can be alerted that there is something NASA put out, that there is a gigantic space rock, also known as an asteroid or a meteor coming into the Earth. So, um, yeah, let's stay in a place of prayer and believe in God that it don't come our way in Jesus' name. So I love you all. God bless you all. And I will see y'all in the next video.